In this quick video, I'm gonna show you how you can embed a calendar inside GroovePages so that someone can book in a call or a meeting with you. So the end result will look something a bit like this. So if they scroll down the page, you can see here is a calendar and you can book in a meeting. And it's also here, if you click schedule a call, it pops up there as well. Now, before I get into it, if you haven't already got your free GroovePages and GrooveFunnels account, it's completely free. Um, I'll leave a link down in the description below. And if you go through that link, you'll also get access to my bonuses as well. And also Groove Calendar is being projected to be released in May 2021. Uh, if you're watching this video and Groove Calendar has been released, the process should be exactly the same of how to embed Groove Calendar inside Groove Pages 2. So it's very simple to embed a calendar inside Groove Pages. All you have to do is go open up a new uh, site and a new page and go to blocks here. And then we'll just do an empty container here, an empty block and an empty container. But you can do this with any kind of block. And you just wanna go to elements, scroll all the way down until you get to the code embed element, drag that into that container there. And then once you've got this code embed element, you need to go over to your calendar app. Now the one I use is Calendly and that's a free uh, calendar booking, appointment booking uh, app. Uh, so I'd recommend using that. If you've already got group, group calendar when it comes out, then um, you can use that too. And with Calendly, all you have to do is you click on the settings here, click add to website to get the code. And we wanna just click inline embed. And this is the same if you just use this function if you if you want to um, do it for a pop-up or for a just anywhere in your website. And all you have to do is copy this code here. So copy that whole code across. And then we want to go back into Groove Pages, click on the embed, make sure you're on the embed thing in the breadcrumbs here, and then just click on this settings tag here. And then you want to paste in that code save and there you go your calendar there uh, will appear and if you want to make changes say you want to make it uh, if it's on if it's like half the length and you want to make it wider or longer all you have to do is go into settings again and just edit these two um, numbers here the width and the height to so say we want to make this a lot longer we can just delete that and we'll just say a thousand and then click save and as you can see the code embed um, element is a lot longer than out there. So if we preview this, um, you'll see the calendar a bit clearer. There we go, and that's all there is to it. So if you um, have any future video suggestions, just leave them in the comments down below. Other than that, I hope you have a great day, hope you have a great week, and I'll see you in another video.